This is the trainer residence, 437 West Division. Our house is a little over a hundred years old, graced by our oak tree, over 250 years old. So look at our neighborhood, Division Street, and looking down. Susie Knox's, Ruth's, on down the street. A closer look now. At night, the amber lights shine up on the trees in the house. A view of the east side. Again, the front. Get out of the way of the trees. Now into the backyard, the patio, clubhouse, I've stepped back to get a little different picture. Pool. It saw a lot of activity this summer. We're back by our little clubhouse now. It's the back side of the house, the girls' room up there. here at the side that I forgot about yesterday. Right down here. Four handprints and a paw print. Our children and dogs signature a year ago when we did our cement work. Coming into the house now. This is our front porch. There's Tourette. Thought that was the door. Hi, cute And David reading the evening paper. And Todd's feet. A recently stripped doorway into the entry hall. There goes Todd flying upstairs. Our family grouping.
and into the living room. There's our girls. There are boys. Another family grouping. A very common sound. Into the dining room. This was Grandma, my Grandma and Grandpa's dining room set. The pieces of cut glass were wedding gifts from my Grandma and Grandpa when they were married. And many of the pieces in my hutch are the same. As you can see, it's close to Halloween. Oh, yes, ma'am. Our printer's box has mementos from all our vacations, as well as just some special little items. My desk, some aloe awards. Yes, Mom. A picture from France. Yes, Mom. And now into the kitchen. Into the kitchen. The most ro used room of the whole house. My window is decorated for Halloween. And my hutch. This is the toaster from the cottage where my grandfather used to make his toast every morning. Going now into the bathroom, our shower. Also Fritzel spot. And one more room off the kitchen. laundry room. Going into the laundry room. Upstairs now. This is our landing area. Grandma's sewing machine. My, one of my aloe plants. Looking out over the neighborhood in the sunlight. And up we go. First room on the left is Todd's room. 
labeled appropriately. Lots of decoration in here. You can tell Todd's our sportsman. The Arches Workshop. And here we have the trophies. Look at the trophies. Years of tumbling and swim team. More posters. More trophies. Todd and Bedmate. Hi, Todd. Hi. Todd's 13. Next room is ours. That is the table my dad made when he was in high school woodworking class. family. Pictures that I've painted. And this is the dresser that belonged to Dave's great grandparents and they brought it from Kansas to Illinois in a covered wagon. Going out here, right across the hall, we have the girls' room. Beth and Kira. Hi, girls. Hi. We're just going to pan around this room now. Beth has her little sign on the door. Her desk. They have a nice warm water bed in the, for the winter time. There's Kira and Beth. Over here we have a little girl I painted for Beth. Doll cradle. Swing back here a moment so you can see Beth's trophies. Lots of tumbling and swimming trophies and medals. Now we'll swing around here. Kira's dresser. Posters from Daddy to his girls. Kira's is the kitty. Beth's is the piano. Here's Beth's dresser. Kira is almost four. Beth is ten. The little girl wearing the dress Beth wore when she was two years old. Little foot on patrol sign made by brother Trent for Kira. Hi. To Trent's room. We begin with the door. A whole variety of messages. Okay, Beach. Open away. 
And in we go. Lights. The walls are very interesting in this room. They've changed a little over the years. The computer corner. Lots of trophies from days of tumbling and swim team. Lots to look at. Oh, the mirror again. My light is out. We're trying our best here. Does that light work over there? Why don't you flick that on? That gives a little more light. Oops, that's not working now. There's the... Shut off? Yeah, the weather shield flag that Trent just made. Stereo, shoe, picture of the shoe that Todd drew for him, is the upstairs bathroom. Down this way from the kitchen is the basement. Down the stairs. A family room area. bathroom off of it. The oxen yoke from the cottage hanging where our fireplace will be before too long we hope. This is the area where the daycare spends a lot of time. beds, all tucked in here, and a grand play area. Lots of activity goes on here every day. And in this area is my workroom. lots of storage and lots of workspace. Also sleeps a little one at this point. And this is our house. We're definitely into winter now. Just about Christmas, 
It's now 12 below zero with a wind chill of 66 below. Unbelievable. But we've made some changes to the front of our house. It's got a little different look along with our Christmas decorations. Cold out here today. It's Christmas at our house. Everything is very festive. Our pine cone wreath made from pine cones from the cottage. And also some from my Girl Scout camp in Wisconsin. Our door is finished and back on the house. Our Christmas tree. Lots of special memories in that tree. And on the piano is my special Dickens Village. Compliments of David. The nativity scene that we had in Hinsdale when I was growing up. And our stockings, a whole group of us. Now on into the dining room, my beautiful Christmas goose, and my darling new nativity scene made by Ruth, my neighbor, and my Lucia, just like the one we had in Hinsdale, given to me by mom and dad because of the Swedish in our family, my grandma. This is upstairs too. Every room has its own special tree and the ornaments have been growing as the kids grow. This is Trent's, of course. Jeez. <laughs> Here we have our yearly gathering under their stockings. Hi, guys. Hi. Hello. Another yearly tradition, the gathering on the stairway. There used to be one little person on that stairway. Now we filled it up. Kira, hi Silly, hi. and Beth, and Todd, and Trent. Silly's. Yeah. Another trainer tree. This is Todd with his collection of goodies over the years. Hi. Beth and her tree. And over here is Kira and her tree. Each ornament is dated and labeled. From look at my Christmas window in the kitchen. And then on downstairs. It's been happening to this basement in the last couple weeks. We've added a fireplace. We have a mantle yet to come. But the oxen yoke is still over it. We've added an entertainment center that will be filled with TV, stereo, and such. Rearranged a bit. We've added our wall clock, or our wall phone. Carpeting, which is partially down. The bathroom has been repapered. There's a shot of the other side of the basement. The door's still off the wall, off the doorways. We're in the process, there's our padding and carpeting, of repapering my workroom also. A very different sight down here. Our family room now. A shot at night. Merry Christmas, everyone. <laughs>